All right, I just got a box of snails in the mail. So let's do a snail in the mail video. This is our new puppy, Summer, and you'll be seeing a lot of her in the future. All right, let's uh, get the box here and let's see how they're shipped. All right, here we are. This is from uh, Grant for, uh, from Florida to Washington State. I'm out at Monday, got here on Wednesday. I've got shrimp from Grant before. It's always a great guy to deal with. Check him out. Let's see what we got here. We got some styrofoam here. Let's zoom out a little bit. We got some insulation here. Looks like this could be a little bit messy. Hmm, let's go over to the sink. So these are snails, but they're not any snails. They are rabbit snails. So I already have rabbit snails, but these are orange rabbit snails. I have yellow rabbit snails. What did I get? I got three in this bag. I see they're shipped underwater. And we got three in this bag. So they're about an inch big. You know, rabbit snails can get uh, two or three inches. My yellow ones are over three inches. And those guys make a lot of babies. So let's go ahead and um, start acclimating these. You know, these guys do best in a sandy bottom. So let's figure out what tank to put them in. So we gotta figure out what tank to uh, put these guys in. Uh, these sandy tanks up here already have uh, the yellow, the yellow rabbit snails in them. So we're gonna go to the other room. The bottom tanks, the uh, pH is too low. We need a Neo Cardinia tank to put them in. I could put them in this tank right here. There is already some orange ones in there. That'd be a good one. There's assassin snails in this tank. Could take that out. This tank we could get some. And I think I'll put some in this tank over here. All right, so let me go ahead and put some of these out and start drip acclimating these. Oh, check out the cool colors on these guys. I really like these, man. Nice snails, uh, Grant. Thank you. Oh, the poor guy flipped over. These guys over here are working their way out too, so. This guy here is already flipped over. All right, I gotta uh, get these guys ready and put them in their new home. One more thing I did is did a dip test in their water. See the KH on this one. This one here is lower than this. This one here pretty much matches my tank. This one here, I have a few tanks with lower cage, but I better uh, drip acclimate these guys over here with the lower cage. Oh, jeez. Somebody found a play spot underneath the aquarium stand. Okay, here she comes. I don't know what she's doing. Oh yeah, one of the orange snails just flipped over. There's another one right here. The uh, orange rabbit snails. All right, let's see if this guy here, how he gets out of this predicament. He's got a little shrimp there helping him. So this tank is the... This tank is the LR Bretts Fire Reds. Let's see if I can get, oh, I don't know if I can get a picture of that Fire Red right there. But this is um, his line. That guy's almost over. And then watch him, when they get out, he can flip his snail back over. He can flip his shell back over. It's pretty cool. There he goes, look at that. How cool is that? These guys are really cool. Here's one. If you don't have any rabbit snails, 
You definitely need to get some. I have uh, a number of other rabbit snail videos on my channel. So you want to subscribe, check those out. Here's one of the, I think we can focus on that. It's close to the edge. One of the fire red shrimps. Sorry, I can't get that in focus very good. They've had a lot of, a lot of babies in here, so that's a good thing. Thanks for watching, guys. And thank you, Grant, for these awesome rabbit snails. I love rabbit snails. I'm looking for some spotted rabbit snails next. Those are really hard to find. If anybody has any, just be sure to message me. And I am interested. If you like rabbit snails, click that thumbs up button below. There's a third one in here somewhere. I don't know where they went, but this is a sandy bottom, so they actually can bury themselves pretty quick in the sand. Over here are the other three. They're acclimating. And they're all alive and moving, though. So cool. Thank you for watching.